With all of these yummy sweets and treats we've been making for our dolls lately, we needed somewhere large to store and display them. So I am going to make a sweet shop counter for a doll using recycled paperboard, scrap of paper, empty glitter jars, coated paper clips, beads, Mod Podge or clear school glue, glitter, craft paint, clear plastic from packaging, tissue paper, skinny sticks, and glue. I start by measuring and cutting strips of paperboard. Apply glue and stack four together. Take another strip and measure it to the doll. Round off the corner. Trim off the excess. Use it as a guide to make more. Glue four together. If I was making this for a larger doll like an 18 inch, I would simply double it using eight layers instead of four because more layers makes it stronger. Repeat to make three. Begin gluing them onto the rectangle. Make thin strips of stacked paperboard. Make measurements going up the sides. Glue the strips at the measurements. Cut layered paperboard and glue it onto the first rack. Cut another piece to glue on front. Paint it. Cut a piece of clear plastic from packaging. Glue it onto the front. Measure skinny sticks. Cut. Paint. Glue it on for support. Trim the edges with paper. Cut pieces of clear plastic. Glue thin strips of paper around the edges then glue them inside. Using our muffin video, we only colored the lower half to make cupcakes. Use craft paint for sprinkles and to color the frosting. Or glue on glitter and beads. We glued small circles of tissue paper on the bottom for cupcake liners. Cut more clear plastic, glue on some of the doll's favorite treats like our brownies and chocolate chip cookies, donuts, sugar cookies, candy apples, pie, and if we paint the pie a light yellow, mix a little Mod Podge and a drop of paint, add a little bit to the top, a few small beads, carefully cover it with more of the mixture to make cheesecake. Slide the treats into the case. We cut circles out of scrap of paper and place our cakes on top, then place them on the lower shelf. We store extra treats in the bottom shelf on the back. All of these food items can be found on videos in our playlist. Fill empty glitter jars with sweets and treats from previous videos. I can even use the coating from a white paper clip and a bead to make a new version of our lollipops with a thinner stem. Place the jars on top and you're done. Happy crafting! Sophie, are you ready to order? I 
have to pick just one, right? Order whatever you like. This just became the best day ever. We want to give a shout out to Faith Hope Video Sisters. What's up? I'll take one of each, please. Oh, no, wait. Make that two. 